Hello everyone, this is Showtime Moment 2. We are again covering the Indo-Pakistani War of 1971. It was initiated by the independence movement in eastern Pakistan, which triggered Indian involvement. Pakistani Air Force is usually described as having a primarily defensive role in this conflict, but it doesn't mean that they weren't conducting any offensive operations. Most of those included attacking Indian air bases and radars in an attempt to reduce the enemy's numerical superiority. In fact, the very first act of the Pakistani Air Force were airstrikes against Indian air bases. They produced very limited results, so they had to be repeated over and over during the conflict. One such mission was flown against a heavily defended Jamnagar air base by a pair of F-104s on 13th December. Pakistani starfighters were used for such attacks because of their speed, but ordnance limitations confined them to strafing attacks. The flight leader was Wing Commander Mervyn Middlecoat, a pilot with a very interesting career. His name doesn't sound like a typical Pakistani name. He wasn't a mercenary pilot or, or anything like that, he simply had a partial English ancestry. He was born during the colonial period and became a citizen of Pakistan as the nation gained independence. He was one of the first Pakistani pilots to fly the F-86 Sabre and later also the F-104 Starfighter. He commanded the squadron during the 1965 war when he scored a possible kill on an Indian camera. He then went to Jordan as an instructor and some sources say that he flew with the Jordanian Air Force during the 1967 war. The outbreak of the Indo-Pakistani War of 1971 found him in Jordan. He returned to Pakistan and volunteered to fly this mission. As the two Pakistani starfighters were approaching Jamnagar Air Base, coastal observation posts spotted them, which alerted Indian defenses. Two QRA MiG-21s took off from Jamnagar and commenced a combat air patrol 10,000 feet overhead the base. One of the Indian pilots was Flight Lieutenant Barad Bushan Soni. Middlecote made one strafing pass over the air base. Uh, he hit some aircraft, which Indians claimed to have been decoys and then egressed the area after his wingman, Flight Lieutenant Habib.
two Indian MiGs dived on the F-104s and Flight Lieutenant Sony first launched a missile which missed the target. The ML version that Indians flew didn't carry an internal gun, but Sony's aircraft carried a gun pod. He fired several bursts at Middlecote F-104. Middlecote then ejected, a parachute was observed and the boat was even sent to rescue him, however his body was never found. Flight Lieutenant Habib, the wingman, tried to engage the mix, but faulty auto-stabilization system prevented him and he had to break off and escape. I hope you liked the video, if you did be sure to press the like button, you can also follow us on Instagram and Facebook, if you're able to you can support the channel on Patreon, there you can find exclusive content and depending on your tier you can get early access or even vote for video topics. Subscribe if you haven't done so already and keep watching Showtime on too.